Greetings, this is Earthman, earthmansoil.com. God bless you, and I hope you're doing well today. Um, this is a follow-up on an earlier video. Um, I've been having problems with uh, insects, uh, leaf munchers, really tearing up some of my flowers and my broccoli and, other and some other plants. And so I'm trying to deal with it. And uh, what I did is I took a gallon of water uh, maybe a little bit more and I put in there um, a cup of loose tobacco pipe tobacco and let it sit for about uh, three four maybe five hours I forgot in the Sun um, and I, then I strained it out uh, into this container and as you can see it this is the uh, you know the shade that you want like a like a brown tea and um, then what I did is I took a tablespoon and a half about of cayenne pepper and I put that in there so now when I'm ready when I'm ready to use it I'm gonna shake it really good and I'm gonna add one cup per gallon of water and um, I'm also gonna put about a teaspoon maybe less about a half teaspoon of Dr. Bronner soap per uh, per you know cup and so I'd put like for two gallons I'd put maybe a teaspoon of Dr. Bronner in there so what you got is Dr. Bronner tobacco juice and cayenne now, you don't want to spray tobacco juice on all your plants, okay? There are some plants that are in the tobacco family and they could cause a bigger problem than the pest if you were to use it. Now, the plants you don't want to use tobacco juice, okay, is on pepper plants, tomato plants, and potato plants, okay? Um, do not use tobacco juice on them because it could be a problem. I'm gonna use neem mixed with a little bit of Dr. Bronner and some cayenne and maybe a little bit of vegetable oil in there too just to emulsify it but for my broccoli and all my flowers the hollyhocks and uh, um, uh, I have some zinnias and uh, sunflowers and some other flowers that the that the bugs are you know just tearing up I'm gonna use this okay and then uh, on all my other stuff I'm gonna use uh, the neem with cayenne oil and Dr. Bronner. So um, that's uh, the use of tobacco. That's how I made it. And that's uh, how I'm gonna apply it. And that is how, the, what plants I'm going to use it on and what plants I'm not gonna use it on. So this is important information, guys. Uh, if you have an insect problems, this is one way to deal with it. God bless you.